Okay, children of Aquarius, it's time for another cosmic happening. We'll try not to harsh on your realm as we bring you, by extremely popular demand, the Beatles. This fight has been a long time coming. Everyone knows about the ugliness that went down recording Let It Be. Since then, the band drifted apart, and they've never had the occasion to vent the anger that's built up over the years. Until now. So, mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the baddest beetle of all? Let's see if they can work it out in a little something we call a hard day's fight. In this corner. Sick of playing third fiddle behind Paul and John, George Harrison. And in this corner, the one most likely to make paid celebrity endorsements later in life, Ringo Starr. In the far corner, the one that looks like a girl, Paul McCartney. And finally, the genius, the Eggman, the witty one, John Lennon. Boy, I don't mind your music, but I'd like you more if you hadn't stolen your famous hairstyle from me. Well, let's get it on! They may call him the funny one, but there's nothing humorous about the damage Ringo is doing to George's karma. Oh, no, no, no. You're doing it all wrong, you two can faced was it? Whenever the control freak, Lennon is taking over for Ringo and pummeling Harrison in perfect 4-4 time. Looks like I might need a little help from my friends. I'm sick of you hogging all the attention just because I'm not conventionally handsome. <laughs> Incredible! It looks like Paul may be dead! John, I know I'm not the best drummer in the world, but I thought we were friends. Can't we all just come together over me and my dead body? I always like Pete best. You've hurt me feelings. So will this. Look out, Paul may not be dead after all. I think he's here to fix that loose floorboard. Okay, Lennon, where do you get off asking how do I sleep? I sleep fine, and you will too after this. Oh, and McCartney's silver hammer comes down upon Ringo's head. Well, one thing's for sure, he'll never play a caveman in a movie. Thanks, mate. I was going to do that. Oh, ow! My very old. What did he just say? Sounds like he was talking backwards or something. Let's check the instant reverse replay. I very old. There I admit it. I'll even tell you where out behind Abbey Road Studios. It was great fun. Whoa! Now to knock the sheep out of this bloody hippie. What? What did I do? It's your fault our records got so weird, you... You traveling Newbury! <laughs> and Harrison is out of it! More so than usual. What in Harry Krishna's going on? If I understand my Hatha Yoga correctly, McCartney's hammer blow must have inadvertently realigned Harrison's chakras, causing him to reach Kundalini. Far out. Beautiful man, I'll have what he's smoking. And I thought all that spiritual crap was a load of bollocks. Now that I've reached the ultimate inner peace, what should my first act of divinity be? I know, I'll put more of me songs on the records. Not bloody likely. Oh, oh, yeah, McCartney and Leonard are giving Harrison a royal beating. More like a royalty beating. They clearly don't want to give up any precious album space. And George Harrison makes his final trip across the universe. You always were a fan of symbolism, John. Oh, you! you better run for your life if you can, because my solo career is about to take off like your frizzy head. What? What the hell is that amazing singing? It's the voice of an angel. It's the sound of the heavens. It's Yoko. I don't believe it. Yoko Ono's beautiful singing voice has washed over these fighters like some kind of spiritual sound. Or perhaps an ointment. And it looks like the war is over. At least the one in the ring. I Paul, I'm sorry. No matter how much I want to kill you sometimes, I have to remember that the music always brings us together, man. Thanks, brother. And now as a tribute to 
peace and love, we'd like to play 40 or so never before heard Beatles songs for you wonderful Deathmatch fans. Unprecedented, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe what I'm seeing. We call this first song Revolution Number 10. A one, a two. <laughs> Tonight on CBS, it's JAG! Big JAG action, big JAG thrills, big JAG deal! What the... what happened to the tape? Oh, shoot. Don't tell me. You have the only copy of this historic Beatles fight with all these new songs, and you record it over it? Tell me it's not true! Oh, well, what can I tell you, Johnny? I'm a JAG maniac. You're a JAG off! Sorry, folks. I'll make sure he pays for it. For Celebrity Deathmatch, I'm Johnny Gomez. And I'm... A dead man. Good fight, good night. You stupid... Ow! 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 Ow